Across Europe, the picture appears the same. Citizens of some of the world's wealthiest nations queuing for work. In Britain, worrying indications that even a dramatic fall in the headline rate of joblessness has little impact on youth unemployment. Associate Professor of Finance Terence Tsi says Europe's losing the skills of an entire generation. Youth unemployment is a major issue. Uh, people said it's a time bomb in waiting. I would say it is actually the next crisis of Europe and in Britain. That crisis comes as Bank of England Governor Mark Carney says the UK economy is on the mend. Despite that, according to Britain's left-leaning Institute for Public Policy, the young in Britain are experiencing a jobless recovery. A million 18 to 24-year-olds without work or training. These students here are among the European elite, but even they are feeling the pressures of youth unemployment. Staying in your home country and expecting to get a job is no longer an option. French people or even Italian should try to find a job not only in their own country but uh, in all Europe. I mean, these guys are now moving uh, to Germany, to France, to Britain, where the jobs are. Hopefully, you know, the, our education will help us to create perhaps employment in the future and things will get better. There are some, though, looking at a lost generation across Europe despite expensive political initiatives. I think they finally realise that this is an issue they need to tackle. What is, I think is important is basically, one, getting the younger generations to be a lot more entrepreneurial so that they can start hiring themselves and the others. And to fail, according to the World Economic Forum, could see youth unemployment tearing apart the social fabric of the European Union. Richard Bessick, CCTV, London.